Yo, what's going on, guys? So today we're going to be going over the New Balance 574 Legacies. Uh, the particular model of the shoe is going to be U574LGB1. Uh, I did get a size 12, which is my normal uh, true to size fit, and the 574 models. Uh, this is pretty much going to be a collaboration with New Balance and Bodega. Uh, pretty much their internationally known uh, collaboration. The price for these were uh, $130. And I did cop these on the Bodega website, uh, which they did release July 15th. And they are coming out on New Balance's website uh, July 22nd. So pretty much just going over this uh, box. You have your New Balance Bodega. And then on top of the lid, you have the New Balance Bodega also. On the sides, pretty much the same thing. And then right here, you have 15 years, uh, pretty much of the New Balance Bodega collaboration. So yeah, let's get into this unboxing. All right, so taking these out of the wrapper. The wrapping paper is going to be the New Balance branding with the Bodega branding with the 15 years, uh, playing pretty much the collaboration. So, taking these out. That one. Yeah, that one. Alright, so you're greeted with the Bodega and then the internationally known, locally respected Bodega New Balance. And then you have the New Balance internationally known 574 Classic Bodega with the New Balance branding. So this particular colorway is going to be the Arrivals. And then they did come out with another colorway in blue, which is uh, pretty much a departure. So I'll leave a picture so you guys can check that out. All right. So starting off you do get um two extra laces so the standard lace is going to be this white lace right here with the red uh bodega on the shoelace tips don't know if you guys can see that and then i did swap this one out for the gray uh shoelaces and this one comes with the yellow bodega on the shoelace tips and then you also do get a yellow mustard color uh with the bodega in the blue on the shoelace tips so starting off as far as quality wise um the material the suede material is very very good um it's just a, it has a nice a nice feel to it i'm not sure if these were made uh if these are made in the USA or if they're, you know, from overseas. But honestly, the material on these are very, uh, very good quality suede. So, so starting off with the front toe area, you do have that yellow suede up front. And then on the toe box, you're going to have that mesh with that 3M reflected uh, material on the top part. And then making your way to the side, you have the suede also continuing right here with the New Balance logo with that 3M reflected. And then on your ankle area, you have that perforated suede. And then you also have some more suede in that grayish color. And then you have your end cap. So this is going to be a little bit different, uh, I believe, because this is the legacy model. So right here, I have another 574. So you can kind of see that the legacy model uh, sticks out a little bit more in the back. Not too crazy, but pretty much different from your typical uh, New Balance. And then also on this one, uh, you have that stitching on that New Balance uh, heel cap versus this one. There's no uh, stitching at all. As far as uh, the bottoms, I would say this one has more, way more traction. I mean, even though I wore these, I don't wear these much. So you can kind of see the traction uh, comes out more. And then the bottom design is also different on the Legacies versus the regular 574s. Um, 
but yeah, so you have that end cap, and then you have your heel cap, pretty much in that yellow, um, I want to say hard plastic material. The end cap is pretty much going to be like a soft, um, I want to say like a rubber, rubber material. And then your midsole, pretty much that white midsole. The back, you have your New Balance with a 3M uh, reflected on that heel area, well, on that ankle area. And then coming on the inside, you have that perforated uh, New Balance logo and that yellow. So the outside is going to be that 3M. And then the inside is pretty much going to be the perforated uh, suede New Balance logo. So that's pretty dope. So your sock liner area is going to be a soft uh, blue material. And then your insoles, let me see. It's going to be your insoles pretty much 15 years, uh, bodega. And you do have your standard uh, insole that you would get in your normal 574s. So the tongue is going to be a suede uh, material with a gray suede. And then you have that yellow mesh. And then on top of the tongue part, it says New Balance Internationally uh, 574 Classic Bodega. Pretty much like this tag that I showed you right here. And then on the inside of the tongue, it says, thank you for copying. So that's that. So yeah, it looks, looks dope, man. When I seen these, definitely had to cop those. Uh, I might just end up getting the blue ones also, uh, just because they're just sitting. Like, honestly, I thought these were going to be, you know, one of those quick, you know, quick hits. But they're actually still on Bodega's website. All sizes are still available. Uh, the sizes range between 7 and 12. Uh, you do get some half sizes in there. But if you guys are interested in these, I'll leave the link uh, for Bodega's website. Uh, like I said, they still have them. And New Balance is also dropping them on their website on the 22nd. So, um... Another thing I noticed too, it looks like you have like a reflected on the um, shoelaces on these gray ones. It's like a reflective material in there also. So that's pretty dope. But uh, I'm going to go ahead and try these on, let you guys see how they look on feet. Many men, many men, many, 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 many men. Many men. They won't leave me be, dog. I can't ride no more. I put my fears to the side some more. But have mercy on many men. Many, 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 many men. They won't leave me be, dog. I can't cry no more. I got me crying to the sky some more. But have mercy. And it's my gift inside. I only rap to switch the vibe. I'm looking for myself. I do so much just to live twisted lives. I don't need sympathy. It's fucked up how I realize. I tell people I'm happy, but reality, I'm just a mom. And I've been sipping mode. The only way to grip the soul, I drink away my problems. Drink too much, the shit I can't control. Nicotine abuse, it got me fucked up like I itch to smoke. I puff up, then I pass it just to have me feel like shit some more. Do my best up in my section, but when born a fucking accident, depression's on my checklist. With my creep up on my but that's pretty much how they look on feet. I also forgot to mention, uh, they did come out with some sweats and a sweater to pretty much go with the outfit. Um, pretty much it'll go with, you know, whether you get the arrivals or you get the departures, it pretty much go with both. Um, I believe those are still on Bodega's website. I think they're retailing for around 120 to 130. I'm not quite sure. But I will leave a link in the description down below where you guys could uh, cop these at. Like I said, they are sitting on Bodega's website. So if you guys are interested in these, you guys can head over there and check them out. Um, but yeah, if you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys smash that like button. Also subscribe and hit that notification bell to stay updated on the latest videos. Um, the next shoes... I will be dropping are going to be the up there uh new balance collaboration once those come in 
But um, yeah, I'll catch you guys next time.